situation six input seventy five thousand that is direct material output sixty six thousand normal loss fifteen thousand actual loss nine thousand so all the others that means production overheads and labor cost same as earlier one okay so this is situation number six first of all let's record the direct lab material we are having 75000 kilograms value of the os is 750000 then direct labor cost at the beginning we have been given 525000 production overheads 225000 Okay, then here you can see there is a normal loss. Actual loss is 9,000. Normal loss is 15,000. That means actual loss is less than the normal loss. That means simply that scenario we can identify it as abnormal gain. As well, and also these are not having any strap values not having any strap values strap value we got in a can normal loss a bit we can give me heck yeah okay let's see so first of all as i suggested we need to balance we need to have equal value with both of the both uh, both uh, quantity columns of both sides so here output we have been given Output have been given as 66,000 kilograms. Still, we don't know the value. 66,000 kilograms. The normal loss. Normal loss also has been given as 15,000. Here we can put simply zero because normal loss is not having any strap value. Earlier one, that means in situation five, what we was done is the actual loss is greater than the normal loss. That means we identified that point as abnormal loss. Here you can see abnormal loss. This, this is the situation number five. So 6,000. In this particular situation, we are having abnormal gain. That means output is greater than what we expected. output So abnormal gain we can record from debit side. We record abnormal loss. I hope that you may remind that. We recorded the abnormal loss in credit side. So abnormal gain, we need to record debit side. How many units? 15,000 normal loss, 9,000 actual loss. Difference between actual loss and normal loss, that is the abnormal gain. Then here, abnormal gain, 6,000 units, 6,000 units. Still, we don't know the uh, value, but now we can check that whether quantity columns are equal or not. Them balanda pulvang quantity columns equal the key. Here total is 81,000. Here total 81,000. Now, as I suggested to you, our assumption is what value of a good output equals to the value of a 
normal uh, no, value of a abnormal loss or abnormal gain one unit. Again, Honda Eka Kaka Metana, Honda Kilogram, Eka Kapiri, Samana Venema, Honda Ape uh, abnormal gain unit take carry, abnormal loss unit take carry cost take it. So, first of all, let's calculate cost of unit. Processed cost of unit processed equals to production cost of the process divided by expected. good units then here production cost direct material plus direct labor plus production overhead we identified that 1.5 million expected good units equals to Inputs here seventy five thousand. Hat the panda hang up a balaburu to any pahalus da kapati ikela. That means expected good units seventy five thousand. Here it should be seventy five thousand. Yes, minus normal loss fifteen thousand. Then value of a unit cost of a unit equals to rupees. 25. Now we can put the value for here 66,000 into 25, 1650. And also, as we did in the earlier sum, abnormal loss also we calculated based on this value. So, abnormal gain, in case of abnormal gain, also we can do the same. Then 6,000 into 25. 150,000. Now let's check the balances. Yes, same. And here, we, as we are having the abnormal gain, we can have abnormal gain account. Process account debit, then abnormal gain account. Credit as process one hundred and fifty thousand. End of the day, we can transfer this hundred and fifty thousand into PNL account. As we are not having the normal loss savings value here, no need to do any additional adjustments. But if we are having a bit of make a we could under. Full one non normal loss segment and additional uh, calculation uh, adjustment. Okay, take this. Okay, then we can move to next one. Situation number seven. Situation number seven. Here input 75,000, output 66,000, normal loss 15,000, actual loss 9,000. Only difference is we can sold out this out uh, straps 10 rupees per kilogram. Okay, for 10 rupees per kilogram. Again, calling a katavada venas in a pute metana make a Apataya, Samanya Apataya, Apita Vikun and the Pulwangira Kianama, Rupia the Hayagar. Okay, without wasting time, let's move. Situation number seven. First, record the 
uh, cost items as we did normal in the earlier. Direct material, 75,000 kilograms. Value of, 40 of it is 750,000. Direct labor, value is 525,000. Production overheads, value 225,000. And output, otherwise we can put this as P2, process 2 account, 66,000. And we are having a normal loss of 15,000. Is that it? Yes. Then we can identify abnormal gain from this side. Abnormal gain, 6,000. Now, quantity columns here, 81,000. Okay. Now, in this particular case, it is saying that we can sort out these uh, straps for 10 rupees per kilogram. And initially, we have identified we are having a normal loss of 15,000. So, as we did in the earlier cases, we can record this. Now we are in the assumption, we can sold out this 15,000. Then if we sold out, our value of value will be 150,000. Then we can have a normal loss account or otherwise scrap account, scrap selling account, process one account credit 150,000, scrap account debit as P1, process one account 150,000. Just wait. Now let's calculate the output value of a unit, cost of a unit processed equals production cost. Now, as I explained to you in previous session, when we are having a scrap selling value, we can use that scrap selling income to cover the cost of the process. Okay, then we can we should deduct that from the production cost. Api upakalpane karna pute metanadi. Ape perasariye sunbun vikunala ada ema kenavana. A Adayam Perasari Vyadam Avarne Karanda Bhavichikaranda Pulwankiela Bangwarata Sarala Udaharne Kiwa and Umahana Manusegava Bima Vatana Reditika Ituruela Vatana Reditika Vikunala Utpadanevana Adayama E Manusata Igava and Odaike Adala and Umahanda Redi Miradiganda Pavichikaranda Pulwankiela. Then production cost minus strap value 
of normal loss should be divided by expected good units here production cost 1.5 million minus strap value 150000 divided by expected good units in the sense inputs minus input 75000 minus normal loss 15000 then value tell me the value Twenty two rupees and fifty cents. Now we can have the value for this output sixty six thousand into twenty two point five. Sixty six thousand into twenty two point five equals to one four eight. Five. Then here also we can have that value six thousand into twenty two point five hundred and thirty five thousand. Take the total. One six three five then this one we should transfer into the abnormal gain account. Process one account debit 135,000. Then abnormal gain account should be credit as process one 135,000. Now, another thing we have to do. Earlier case, I think in situation number five, you may note that when we are having abnormal losses, as we are noted that we have wastage than what we expected. So that additional wastage also can be sold out and we can cover the abnormal loss. Then what we did, we did the adjustment through our strap account and abnormal loss account. Here you can see that. Now, other side of that. Here we have identified the abnormal gain. And here we have identified strap selling. But actually what has happened, we expected the 15,000 wastage but actual wastage was 9,000. Now the thing is, my question is, can we earn this 150,000? May 150,000 up it earn current pull one. Pahalosta, Kyanava Kela Hitalatama strap daladi. We cannot go for that. Make it under Babu Mokade. 
normal loss එක 15000ක් අපි අපේක්ෂා කරපු ප්‍රමාණය ඇත්තටම අපතේ ගිහින් තියෙන්නේ නම 10000 6000ක් වැඩිපුර ගිහිල්ලා අපි ඒකත් අඳුරගෙන තියෙනවා අපේ ලාභයක් okay too much of profit so we need to balance that so we can transfer this so abnormal gain can be deducted by using this strategy so what we need to do just transfer the uh, abnormal gain uh, transfer the strap value to abnormal gain account strap value belongs to the 6000 me me 6000 ta adala strap value weka abnormal gain account ekata maru karando okay so how, how to do that one here strap account credit strap account credit as abnormal gain how much hai da hak ne kiya gaane da vikunan ne kiya gaane da vikunan ne da hai gaane then six thousand into ten sixty thousand then abnormal gain account debit as strap Sixty thousand. Then we can balance this. If we assume that we are going to sell this for cash, then balance we can put it into cash account. Meka mudara da vikuna na ma kelo pakal pane kelo mudara da vika kelo hitote ma meke na balance ka ninety thousand. Can make this as cash. Then balance of this account, abnormal gain account, what is the balance? Seventy five thousand. We need to transfer to PNL account. PNL account. Okay. Record this. If you have any doubts, you can ask. Okay. Let's move next one. Situation number eight. We are having inputs. We are having outputs. Abnormal loss is equal to the actual loss. Here, not having strap value, we are having strap cost. What is that? Why here we have put minus ten in the sum? දැන් අර ටේලර් එකේ කතාව ගත්තොත් එහෙම බිම වැටෙන රෙදි ටික ටේලර් ට විකුණන්න බැහැ. නමුත් ඒ වයින් කරන්න එපේ. එහා පැත්ත ඉන්න වෙන මිනිස්සෙට රුපියල් 10ක් දීලා කියනවා අනේ මේ ටික අතු ගාලා දාන්න. ස්ට්‍රැප් අයින් කරන්න වෙන මම පිරිලයක් දෙරි in this particular cases. The particular firm has to incur additional cost to remove the straps so in their, their case we are not having any strap selling value okay as all the other information are same as earlier let's record situation number 8 we can record direct material 75000 kilograms value of this is 750000 then direct labor cost 
525,000. Production overheads, 225,000. Output can transfer to process to account output is 6,000. Anyway, Buddha, here we can identify this normal loss from the credit side. Then that's why we have to make the quantity column balance. Karna quantity columns balance karna kotha, ek api anivarim eliyate na deva landuna kando ne barabat. Okay, then here, Same as earlier, normal loss, normal loss, how much? 15,000, normal loss 15,000. Here normal loss equals to the actual loss, normal loss equal to the actual loss. Then here we are not having any abnormal loss, so abnormal gain. Then here you can see our total columns in case of quantity here 60,000. No? Our total columns in case uh, our quantity columns are equal for 75,000 kilograms. 75,000 kilograms. Now the matter is, earlier we can sold out this strap, but here we are not having any selling value. Well, strap but is sell up it is a selling value because then selling value because So we cannot put any value in the credit side, but we need to incur additional cost of how much? 10 rupees per kilogram of a strap. So, that should be recognized in debit side, the strap. 10 into 15,150,000. Okay, so a strap account. This is a cost account. Process one account credit. Strap account debit hundred and fifty thousand. It's a payable expense. Now we can identify the cost of unit processed. Isella Mukadda Kare, Taylor Gava, Bimati and Redical Vikumala, Ambin Adaiba, Mukadda Kare, Api Pavichikala, I Rediganda. Now, in this particular case, Taylor has to incur additional cost than their production cost to clean this strap. So, cost of a unit processed can be calculated. A Okoma will be a dang hour naker again, load may output. Okay, all the expenses, including strap cleaning cost, we need to cover from this output. So, production cost of the process production cost of the process plus earlier we deducted the strap selling value, but here we have to incur additional cost for cleaning this strap. Therefore, production cost of the process plus the strap value, strap cleaning value, we can say as a strap cleaning value. Divided by expected good units. expected good units here you can see process cost 107 uh, 750000 525000 225000 is earlier we got this 1.5 million 
plus structural in value 150,000 divided by expected good units. Seventy five thousand minus normal loss fifteen thousand. Value. 27 rupees and 50 cents, 27 rupees and 50 cents. This one into 27.5, I have got 16 16.5. Then here take the total. And if we assume that we are paying this strap removing cost by cash, we can transfer this amount to cash. If you have any doubts, you can ask them. Otherwise, take this. Okay, let's move. Now, we are in situation number nine. Situation number nine. Input 75,000 kilograms, output 50. 4,000 kilograms, normal loss 15,000, actual loss 21,000. That means actual loss is greater than what we expected. That means 21,000 minus 15,000, 6,000 is the abnormal loss. Abnormal loss. Then here also we are not having any strap value, but we need to incur additional cost for removing this strap. Okay, let's do this. Situation number nine. Direct material, 75,000 kilograms. Value of those, 750,000. Direct labor, 525,000 production overheads 225,000 out 225,000 yes output can transfer to process to account that is 54,000 and normal loss we are having 15,000. We cannot solve this normal loss as we have to incur the additional cost. Then we noted that actual loss is 21,000. Normal loss is 15,000. Then that means we are having the Abnormal loss 6000. Now, abnormal loss se kakti hai na wa? Six thousand. Okay. Then what we need to do here 
to remove this 15,000 normal loss identified wastage. Methi and a wastage, Kanduna got the perastamin to kernel other wastage. Remove current. Amatara Piriwak, the Rima to sit the Benorupia the Hayagani. So, as we did in previous case, we can transfer that to strap cost account 150,000. 10 into 50. Now let's see whether our quantity columns are equal or not. Here 75,000. Now we can have a strap account. This is a payable expense account. Now let's calculate cost of a unit. Cost of unit processed equals production cost of the process minus scrap clearing cost sorry my plus strap clearing cost deducted by expected good units here production cost we can identify Direct material plus direct labor plus production overheads, 1.5 million. Plus strap cost, 150,000 strap. 150,000 strap clearing cost. Expected good units here, input 75,000 minus normal loss 15,000. Value rupees 27 and 50 cents. Now we can take the value for P2 output. Output 54,000 into 27.5, 1485, 1485. And we know that abnormal gain loss unit cost also equal, equal to 27.5. Six thousand into twenty seven point five. Six thousand into twenty seven point five. Now let's see is that equal one six five zero triple zero. Yeah, one six five zero triple zero. Now we can transfer this abnormal loss account we had to have. We can transfer the abnormal loss into abnormal loss account. Hundred and sixty-five thousand as P two P one. Sorry. Then what the put the villati in me? Api bala porotu na. Pahalosta ha kapate aikiela, even when we are dunker and up yekra chapanasta ha quinkara, Namutisieta ha kapate hila We expected a wastage of fifteen thousand kilograms, 
So we allocated 150,000, but actually we are having 21,000. Venkarapumudal Madhi. So what we need to do, we should have, we should have more. Okay, more. So what can we do? This abnormal loss. Tavato, a badipur apathy gain is up a part of Tavat, where we namukan, that apathy gave way in Karan Damatra Piriak, that and don't. In a metanaki, the Tame Hayada had a pivinkal and a enang a pages men take a current pulwa, metenta Tava Hayada Hakdan, Hayada Hakdarianagan. That means sixty thousand we should put in here. Additional sixty thousand need to remove those straps. That one we can do through the abnormal loss account. Then abnormal loss account debit as straps, 60,000. Balance of this abnormal loss account transferred to 225 transferred to PNL account, profit and loss account. And the strap value, if we assume that we are paying this by cash, two hundred and ten thousand decide also if you have any doubts, you can ask. Situation number 10. Now, what is the case? It's the same. Output 66,000, normal loss 15,000, actual loss 9,000. Normal loss 15,000, actual loss 9,000. That is abnormal gain, abnormal gain of 6,000. As earlier, need to incur additional cost to clean in the strap. Okay. Let's see. Situation 10, direct material cost outputs uh, units 75,000, value 750,000, direct labor 525,000, then production overheads. 225,000. Uh, our output we can transfer to process two account 66,000 and normal loss 15,000. We are not having a selling value. In addition to this, for remove this strap. 15,000, we have estimated the cost for 10 rupees for one kilogram, then strap 150,000. Mm -hmm. Normal loss 15,000, actual loss 9,000, actual loss 9,000. That means abnormal gain, abnormal gain. It should be record from this side, abnormal gain 6,000. Total here 81,000. You can see this side also 81,000. Now let's calculate cost uh, strap. Selling cost we can transfer to the strap account. P1, 
150 i will put like this then cost of unit produced equals to production cost of process plus strap value strap clearing cost divided by expected good units here production cost we know 1.5 million plus strap clearing value 150,000 divided by expected good units in the sense inputs minus expected selling uh, expected normal loss 15,000 then here value rupees 27 and 50 cents we can multiply this 66,000 into 27.5 to get the output 1815. I am doing this as you have now. We have did we have done nine sums. Okay. Then we know that abnormal gain unit cost equals to the good unit uh, value. On the eka keka piriva samana abnormal gain eka piriva in assumption nicking up yanni. Then six thousand into twenty seven point five, then hundred and sixty five thousand. Take the total, this should be one eight one five, then here one eight one five. Okay. Then abnormal gain account we can have process one account debit 165,000 abnormal gain account credit as process one 165,000. Here we have allocated 15,000 allocated 150000 for 15000 but no need that much api 15000 yanawa kiyala hitala 150000 wen karala tibbata strap account ekey strap clear karanda etchara awashya nahe no need that much so we can deduct that one 6 into 6000 into 10 60000 apita adu karanna puluwa we can do this true abnormal gain account then a strap account debit, abnormal gain account credit as a strap. Then we have to do the assumption that we have to do the assumption. Then based on the assumption, we are paying this by cash, that we are going to pay in this by cash. Then 90 we can put into the cash account. Here, Balance of this we can transfer to 225. We can transfer to DNL account. That's the case. Okay, that means we have done 10 situations. Apita exam in a Enda puluang awasta the high the mayo oite hane with awasta the high the ma. So we have discussed all 10. Then uh, basic part that means basic part of process process costing have finished up. Okay. Then we need to discuss when we are having working profits stocks, how we are going to do this. Okay. Okay, practice question. First, let's read this. ASN company produces product X through three manufacturing processes. Information related to the month of October is given below. 
material B, uh, process one. Ekatadano material, they are put in to process one, 25,000, 19,075, 19,880. That is material A. Then direct uh, labor, 15,000, 10,000, 8,000. That means after uh, they are going through three processes. Then process one is started from 1,000 units of A. Again, process one, like main material, like material A. Material A. <coughs> Dahak Dara Tama may process a Batangane, it amateur material B may have a process secretary may may pramana in the AK units gana dirana, post taken the Alatino, A units gana dira dina, the water material A in me, A Tama, a main input tech water, parival the name. Pathway process A started from thousand units of A at rupees thirty each. There is no working progress stock at the beginning or end of the period. No working progress. Output of each process transferred to next process. And at the end of the process, it is transferred to finished good stock. Okay, that means output of process 3 transfer into the finished good stock. Company charge production overhead for each process at 75% of direct labor costs. Direct labor cost in theater had the uh, production overhead. The following information is also provided to you. Process one actual output 950, normal loss 5% of inputs. Inputs are in theater. Uh, process two actual output 840, normal loss 10% from input. Process three 750 output. 15% of input, uh, inputs are the normal loss. Then uh, both of the cases, then uh, of all three cases are having strapped selling values too. Okay. Now what we need to do, we need to prepare process one account, process two account, and process three account together with the related accounts. And we should identify the cost of each. Okay, let's prepare. First, let's prepare process one. Now, how what are the ID we need to identify? Here, main material is material A. Okay, material A. Then process is start with direct material. There are two types of direct materials. First one is direct material A. The quantity has been given thousand. Then 30 each, that means value of it is 30,000. Then there is a material B also, direct material B. B in the sense we have not given any uh, units, number of units. 25,000 is the cost in case of process for 25,000. Then what is saying? No working progress. Production uh, direct uh, labor cost. Yes, direct labor cost in case of process one, 15,000. Here you can see this is the direct labor cost, 15,000. Yes. Then Company charge production overhead for each process, 75% of direct labor charge. Again, direct labor charge again, see at a hatha pahagan all production overhead. Then production overhead equals to 75,000 into 75%. This is the production overhead. Okay, take this 15,000 into 75. 11,200 then. Okay, then let's see the output. Output in the sense process one 950 and normal loss 10 5 percent from the inputs strap value 10. Hari, namasi panaha output taka saman ne apataya see at paha input sorry strap value we could undergo the higher guy. Let's see. 
first output we are going to transfer into P2 account, process 2 we are going to transfer output. Output has been given as 90, 950 kilogram and normal loss normal loss has mentioned 5% from the inputs 5% inputs well in see at here inputs we are having 1000 inputs a bit at the end of the end of the see at a part that means 50 means 50 here you can identify inputs equals to the total of p1 account and and output and normal loss that means everything that has happened as we expected thousand equals 950 and 50 no that means everything has happened as we expected that means no abnormal gain no losses now we can have the total of this total column in case of quantities here thousand yeah so then it has mentioned strap can sold out 10 rupees strap we could end up with one rupee the high cutter take care then 5000 okay so we can have strap account but make it other strap account take a month maybe to you know the water hammer process second mother is strap account to get the money Now process one account again in our so straps five thousand. Okay, then here we can calculate <coughs> cost of a unit. Produced total production cost of the process minus here up it may cover karagana pull on water the air no a came on with an adukaran strap value divided by expected good units <coughs> yeah production cost equals to Eighty one thousand two hundred and fifty minus strap value strap value five hundred. No. Strap value we got Panahaguna Kirima the high pan CA. Minus 500 divided by expected good units. Expected good units we can calculate inputs minus normal loss. An answer eighty five. And we can put the value here. 85 into 950. Value is 80,750.
then we can check the total. Should be eighty one thousand two hundred and fifty. Okay, this is the process one. Take this. Now, main input of process two is output of process one. Process two ke pradhan input tek venne, me process one ne ke output tek. So let's start. Process two account from that. Here, it is start from the output of process one. We have identified 950 kilograms or units. Value of it is 80,750. Then cost material B, they are going to add 19,075. Then labor cost 10,000. Production overhead 75% from the labor cost. Mm -hmm. Direct material B, 19,000. 75 then direct labor 10,000 production overheads 75% from the direct labor cost that means 10,000 into 75% 7,500 that is the production overhead then output is saying 840 strap 10% from the inputs. Value of a strap unit is 20. Okay, let's record. Output is going to transfer to process three account. That one has identified as 840 units. Then we are having normal loss. Normal loss is saying as 10% of main input. Here 915 to 10 in the sense. 95. 915 to 10%. 95. Normal losses are having nine hundred and ninety five into ninety five into twenty ninety five into twenty in the sense. Thousand and nine hundred. Thousand and nine hundred. Now you can identify here. Main inputs we have put nine hundred and fifty units. Then here outputs we are having eight hundred and forty plus. 
मतलब दाल आती है ना वापी ओको में इनपुट टेक विधि है तो नाम से ये पाना हाँ नाम तेरी ये टेबल लती है ने मिल चला दैट मींस समथिंग है वेस्ट दें दे एक्सपेक्टेड यार ला बाला पुरुष तुम्हारे टो वड़ा प्रमाण या आपते एक हिल ला ती है ना ओके दैट मींस वी आर हैविंग abnormal loss abnormal loss එකක් තියෙන නිසා තමයි බලාපොරොත්තු වුණාට වඩා අප දෙකින්ලා තියෙන මේ දෙක එකතු කරගත්තොත් එහෙම මේකට සමාන වෙන්නේ නැහැ මීට වඩා අඩු how much 50 15ක් මත් that means 15 is the abnormal loss abnormal loss එක 15 now we can see our quantity columns are balanced and we have identify a normal loss of 1900 that one can record in same strap account strap account එක සමාන නා process 2 account එකෙන් strap වෙනවා 1900 okay okay thousand nine hundred extra now let's calculate cost of a unit sorry cost of a unit produced equals to production cost of the process minus strap value as we are heavy divided by expected good units here production cost 80750 plus 19075 plus 10000 plus 7500 177 no, 117325 117325 Minus is strap value thousand nine hundred divided by expected good units. Our inputs nine hundred and fifty minus ninety five. Hundred and thirty five. then value of the output we can not 814 to 135 113400 abnormal loss 15 into 135 2000 Here we should have abnormal loss account. Process two account credit 
abnormal loss account debit as process to 2025. Now you can identify, we have allocated more, we have allocated, uh, we have identified strap selling as 95 units for selling the, selling for outsiders as straps, but actual output is 95 plus 50. Anu pahai tawat pahalava kapati hindi, you know. That one also we can sold out. Ekat visagan and vikuna and visagan ekat vikuna and bulwa. So that one can be adjusted through abnormal loss account. How to adjust? Abnormal loss account credit as a strap 20 into 15. 20 into 15. Here the tunsi. Then strap account credit three hundred abnormal loss. Abnormal loss. May count again. I'm that. No. Okay. Take this. If you have any doubts, you can ask. Now let's move to preparation of process account three. Here you can identify, we are transferring 840 units and cost of this was 1134. to process free account. Make any marukaran. That is the main input in process free account. Okay, let's record. We are transferring 19,800, 180, direct labor, 8,000. Direct material B, 19,180, direct labor, 8,000, production overhead 75% from direct labor, see it at the bottom. Production overheads, 80,000 into 75%, that means 6,000. <coughs> Now, after this process, we are transferring the pro product uh, output into finished good disco. May process again pass say, Nimito Gate the Mai Maruka. Okay. 
output of process 3 is 750, normal loss 15 percent, value of out strap unit 30. Finished goods 750, the normal loss. Fifteen percent from the inputs. Eight hundred and forty into two thirty percent. How much thirty percent? Fifteen percent. Fifteen percent. Fifteen percent in the sense hundred and twenty six. This one can sold out for thirty rupees each. That means three thousand seven hundred and eight. Mega tiya gaane bhi kunandu bol. The mega ape strap account ke to daaga. We are having a strap account. Three thousand seven hundred and eight. Okay. Three thousand seven hundred and eight. Now, the balance of the total out total quantity columns. 750 plus 126 equals to 876. 876, Elliot Avila Diana, 840 Daladi. Here, normal loss. We expected a normal loss of 126. That means normal loss, actual loss is less than normal loss. May the balance current on a being end on a we should have 36. That means simply in this particular case, we are having abnormal gain. Okay. Now let's take the total of Quantity columns. Now We need to take the cost of a unit. Cost of a unit equals total cost related to this process is one four six five hundred and eighty. Strap value expected the strap value three seven eight zero. Expected good units inputs eight forty minus x normal loss one two six. Cost of uh, unit rupees two hundred.
Then we can calculate the value of our finished goods. 715 to 200. Hundred and fifty thousand abnormal gain value thirty six into two hundred seven thousand two hundred. We can record it that in the abnormal gain account, process tree account debit, abnormal gain account credit as process tree seven thousand two hundred. Then let's check the total column. One, five, three, seven hundred and eighty. This side also should be one, five, three, seven hundred and Now here what we can notice, we expected the wastage of 126 units, but we saved 36 units from that. Because we see how we have to do it, but we have to do it with the same thing. Okay. We transferred these 126 for Strap account. Tiha gaane ne vikke. Ek sir sir tiha gaane ne vikke. Is saya kapi yau tiha gaane ne vikke bolu. Tiha gaane. Abi tiha gaane maaru karla tiye ne dam meke. But actually we are not having hundred and twenty six because we saved thirty six. So thirty six into thirty. Is saya guna kiri mati ha. We cannot earn through strap setting that one need to be adjusted through abnormal gain account api abnormal gain account eka haraha eka cover karagando so let's put the uh, entry here trap 36 into 30 Thousand eight. Then scrap account. Credit. Thousand eighty. As. Abnormal. Profit. Now everything finished up. Now we can balance this strap account. Balance is transferred. Balance we need to. Uh, we are going to earn through cash. Api ek kanama cash account taking api hamba karana gana actually. Here six thousand 
480 6480 here we are going to earn 5400 this is what earn then abnormal gain account no abnormal loss account we can balance balance is thousand seven hundred and twenty five we are transferring to pnl then abnormal gain Six thousand one hundred and twenty transfer to PNL account. End of the day, this is what we should identify as the finished goods. Finished goods. Okay, that's all. Take this. If you have any doubts, you can ask now.